The resolution gives EU member states authority to inspect, seize and dispose of boats that could be or are being used by organized criminal enterprises for migrant smuggling or human trafficking from Libya. The country's internationally recognized government has given its consent for the operation, the second phase of a three-part campaign aimed at blocking trafficking routes to Europe. With broad agreement, Venezuela was the only country to abstain. The resolution that uh, has been adopted authorizing the use of force, in our opinion, is a, a disproportionate action which sets a dangerous precedent uh, for the treatment of this topic in the future. Uh, we believe that it's not with the use of force uh, against uh, the citizens nor criminalizing this phenomenon. Uh, this is not the way we will resolve this humanitarian tragedy. Several countries called for the root causes of the crisis to be addressed while the UK additionally cautioned that the exploitation of people also had to be stopped. Any action will be proportional in keeping with the limits authorized by this resolution and used solely against the smugglers and empty boats. Any migrants encountered as part of the operation will be taken to Europe as part of established procedures. Sadly, action against the smugglers on the high seas won't solve this crisis alone, but it will send a message that people cannot profit from this evil trade with impunity. It will save lives. Council authorization for the EU operation is for one year. Sherwin Bricepies, SABC News, New York.